kuja hapa na sikuta siku ya leo na asubuhi ya leo tumekuwa kule la net na mheshimiwa rais tumekuwa na pastor parade ya cadets wetu wamesema mradi huu ulianzishwa na mheshimiwa uhuru kenyata mwaka wa 2012 wakati huo alikuwa naibu wa waziri mkuu na vile vile alikuwa waziri wa fedha minister for finance na akaanzisha mambo ya economic stimulus ambayo kulikuwa na miradi iliwekwa sehemu mbalimbali za Kenya ili kuweza kuimarisha uchumi mashinani na nina furaha sana ya kwamba huu mradi haukukwama na tukasikizana na serikali ya county na wafadhili wetu wa EU ili tuweke pesa hapa tukamilishe huu mradi ili tuweze kupata ngombe soko ya ngombe kwa wafugaji wa eneo la North Rift na Kenya nzima na leo nina furaha sana kuwa hapa kuona mradi huu kikamilika Nimekuwa hapa mara kadhaa lakini leo ni siku special kabisa sababu ndio siku nimeona ngombe ikichinjwa na nyama nikaonja nyama mimi mwenyewe hapa sikia. Ni miradi kadhaa tumeanzisha kama wizara ya ugatuzi kupitia mpango wa serikali ya Kenya na EU kufufua uchumi mashinani. Na tuko na mambo kama haya sio tu Westpo Court tumeweka ingine kama hii kule Samburu vile vile upande wa Baringo pia tumeweka uh, aboto wa kama hii na kule juu wajia pia ili tuweze kuhakikisha kwamba counties ambazo zina wafugaji na muko na wanyama tunaweza tukawasaidia waweze kuchinja wanyama hao na wauze nyama kwa soko ya Kenya na pia soko ya kimataifa na pia tumeangalia kwa counties pale si wafugaji ukiwa na counties wana samaki kama Masabit Muto Turukana tumeweka huko kiwanda cha samaki ukiangalia kule kisi nimekuwa huko juzi wana matoke wana ndizi nyingi sana na gava na tumekuwa kwa rafiki yako ngwai tumefungua factory kama hii lakini ni ya ndizi ili kupeana soko kwa wakulima wa ndizi huko pia upande wa Tana River kuna factory kama hiyo ya ndizi na pia nimekuwa migori kwa rafiki yako gava na obado huko wana viazi wamebarikiwa sana wana viazi vitamu sweet potatoes huko pia tumefungua factory ya sweet potatoes ambayo ita process na kuuza viazi kule ngambo na hata hapa Kenya na sio hiyo tu kwa wale wana matunda kama kule makweni wako na mangos tumeweka factory ya fruit processing ambayo itawezesha wakulima waweze kuuza matunda yao pale so huu ndio mpango wa kuhakikisha ugatuzi unafanya kazi ugatuzi mashinani najua wakati huu ni wakati wa siasa e, kuna wale wanaongea mambo ya bottom up sasa leo nataka niwaambie the real bottom up ndio hii sasa hii ndio ugatuzi ile ingine ni story hiyo ni siasa hii ndio the real bottom up yani pesa itoke from the top ikuje hapa mashinani watu wa west coast mkae na governor wenu huyo nyangapo mpange mambo yenu na muboreshe uchumi wenu na hiyo governor i must thank you na nishukuru waheshimiwa mcs nimewaona hapa kuna wakati nilikuja hapa tulikuwa na mambo ya BBI eh, hiyo swala ilikuwa kwa county assembly nikaomba mupitishe hiyo kitu ili tuongeze pesa kutoka 15% hadi 35% na nashukuru mlipitisha hiyo ripoti hiyo ilisimamisha lakini leo wamesema hiyo eh, mambo inaweza angaliwa tena wamesema walisimamisha sababu ya rais alihusika sasa hiyo haisimamishi another initiative ambayo itaongeza pesa from 15% to 35% pesa ikuja hapa nusukuta mingi zaidi mfanye maendeleo hapa sio eti kae Nairobi wenyewe mkae
upange mambo yenu muone bila mtakufua uchumi wenu so hiyo ndio jambo nitaka niseme asanteni kutukaribisha hapa na baada ya siku ya leo wanasema kuzaa mwana si kazi kulea mwana ndio kazi we want to challenge the county government of West Pokot and uh, the leadership of this region. Na kwamba leo tumeanzisha kiwanda hiki. Lakini sasa lazima tuendelee kufanya kazi pamoja. Tuhakikishe ya kwamba kinafanya kazi. Na kupitia wizara yangu nimeuliza PSS wangu wako hapa, PS Korir, PS Owon waweze kushirikiana na PS wa Defense, PS Ibrahim. Tuweze kuweka MOU kati ya ile Kenya Meat Commission na hii na Sukuta Abuto. Tunataka as national government tuwape support sababu kule KMC wana market kubwa. Hiyo partnership professor will make this plant sustainable and we want to assure you of our support. Kwa mambo ya maji nimeshukuru ya kwamba kuna borehole hapa lakini vile tulikuwa tumesikizana na kijana wenu uh, Mika Poon wanasema ahadi ni nini? Poon tulitoa ahadi hapa bana. Tuko na deni ya maji hapa. Hii borehole tumeona professor inafanya kazi lakini lazima tuongeze maji zaidi hapa because we want to expand this place. Ndio? Tumesikia mko na ikari za kutosha karibu 1300. So lazima tupanue hapa na huu mradi tulikuwa tumesema na bwana Poon tutafuatilia ili tuhakishe na wizara ya maji maji yameongezeka hapa. Kwa mambo ya uboreshaji wa mifugo sababu for this to be sustainable lazima kuwe na ile steady supply ya ngombe walio hali nzuri tukiwa na ukame ngombe ikija hapo wamedofika hamtapata faida we will not sustain this place so lazima pia tuangalie mambo ya production na improvement animal husbandry mambo ya magonjwa na hapa kitale tuko na bull station pale Endebes nataka professor pia tuweze kushirikiana nawe na wakulima hapa so that we utilize the bull station hapa Kitale kuboresha mifugo ya West Pokot so that zile mifugo mtaleta hapa ziwe ziko hali nzuri kilo ziwe zaidi na pesa izidi sababu ya uzito wa hizo ngombe tuko pamoja so kazungu hapa wacha ni rudi kwa ile lugha yao ambao wataelewa i am honored to join you today during this important occasion of commissioning of the nascuta export abattoir here in west pokot as you are aware discussions of this project started way back in 2015 when the county uh, when the country was establishing and norming the structures and objectives of the devolved system of government in kenya it is during this period that the government of kenya with the support from the eu established the ideas program to support the devolution process the EU grants targeted 15 counties of Baringo, Kisi, Kisumu, Kwale, Laikipia, Makueni, Masabit, Migori, Nyandarwa, Samburu, Taita Taveta, Tana River, Wasingishu, Wajia, and of course the great county of West Pokot. The aim of this led projects is to contribute to the realization of Kenya's big four agenda in the area of food security and manufacturing as the projects are in the field of agribusiness. These include meat processing, fruit processing, sweet potato processing, maize storage, commercialization of fishing and wholesale markets. The boost in income of participating value chain actors will contribute to job and wealth creation and consequently improved livelihoods. The Nasukuta Export Abattoir, having come through several years of construction from the times of the economic stimulus program, is indeed poised to realize that dream to stimulate local economic development in West Pokot. The Export Abattoir will provide a ready market for livestock producers in West Pokot and support businesses along the value chain. It is part of the activities for the abattoir to process various types of meat and packs for targeted consumers in West Pokot 
within the country and eventually for export. The abattoir is strategic and has improved facilities. It's expected to minimize the role of middlemen, improve the sale margins for livestock producers, and avoid tracking of livestock in trucks to the markets in Nairobi. The processing of the meat into chilled carcasses will thus enhance West Pokot County revenue base through various levies on supplies and purchases. It is important to note that the Nasukuta Export Abattoir has been funded at the cost of Kenya shillings 178 million, with the EU contributing 110 million and West Pokot County contributing over 68 million. Makofi for Professor. I think West Pokot has contributed the most. I've been to several counties. There are those who have been giving 20, others 15 million, but Professor has given over 68 million. Prof. Ongera. Ningekuwa na kura hapa, ningesema lojanga po tano. Iyo njini muta mwata nitisa sasa. has established the West Pokot Meat and Livestock Corporation, I implore on the county to invest in both human and financial resources to support operationalization of the plant, especially at the initial phase. Further, the success of the plant will largely depend on the county engaging professional staff, and I am glad to see that a board chairperson has already been identified. The ministry is available for further discussions on operationalization of the abattoir, with the other line ministries, as I've said, the Ministry of Water and Livestock, and partners to ensure that the West Court County achieves the intended purposes. I wish to appreciate the EU for co-funding the abattoir and also congratulate the West Pocot County team and the Ministry Ideas team for ensuring the successful delivery of this very, very important project. We all look forward to reaping positive benefits that support local economic development in West Pocot and beyond. I actually understand that since construction started, a number of hotels and new houses have developed around the abattoir as a sign of growth of the local economy. The ministry is available to work with the counties in furthering capacity building interventions and technical support towards enhancing local economic uh, development. And it is now my honor and privilege to officially commission the Nascuta Export Abattoir. <laughs>